this is Macomb Mayor Mike Inman coming to you from Macomb City Hall. It's Tuesday, March 24th, 2020, with our uh, update regarding the COVID-19 virus that's currently spreading across Illinois. I'm here to uh, encourage you to continue your efforts in compliance with Governor Pritzker's stop uh, and stay at home order. Uh, we've seen some good results, but I'm still concerned when going to and come, coming from City Hall that there are a lot more people on the streets than we would expect to see. Uh, so please, we're seeking your voluntary compliance with maintaining uh, what the governor has asked under the guidelines that he's asked, that essential personnel only be out uh, and that you're only making trips out for essential purposes. And to remind you about what those essential purposes are, the banks are still open. Many of them have converted to drive-through only. Uh, gas stations are still open. Our pharmacies and grocery stores are still open. As a matter of fact, there are other uh, uh, services that are still available, for, for example, veterinary services, automobile repair services. Uh, the dealerships are actually closed. The showrooms are closed. They're open by appointment, but many of them have parts and repair businesses that are open, as well as our other automotive repair businesses that remain open. Again, uh, the emphasis is on staying at home, and not being in a public setting, reducing your exposure and the possibility that you may be exposing other folks. So if you have concerns about what businesses are open or are listed as essential, please check the Macomb Chamber of Commerce website at macombchamberofcommerce.com. There's a complete updated list of those businesses. And again, we'd remind you that if uh, you have symptoms that you not go directly to your uh, primary care to provider or directly to the hospital right now. You should make phone calls to your primary care provider or the hospital before you just go there. You'll get some guidance. They'll ask you some questions, talk about what uh, symptoms you may be having. So currently uh, there are no reported cases in McDonough County, but we are prepared for the inevitability of those to uh, come. Uh, speaking of prepared, we have met and set up a uh, uh, emergency operations uh, center here in the county where all countywide partners are staffing that center. It was started today. Um, very pleased with how that has started up and uh, although we're not looking forward to putting it in operation, we are prepared to, to do that when the time comes. Um, we'd again remind you to make phone calls to those folks that are homebound, offer them encouragement and and um, if it is essential that you provide them with some service they're not otherwise able to get from an existing business, please be aware that um, to check the following websites for those um, essential services. That would be uh, Illinois Department of Public Health. There'll be a link there to check that. That's dph.illinois.gov. And if you're still concerned about what to look for for the coronavirus as far as symptoms and protocols on disinfecting and things like that. Those are good questions and they can be very easily answered by checking the CDC's website and that is cdc.gov. And over the next couple of days, we're gonna be rolling out additional ways to communicate with you that involve some of our essential businesses that are open and providing you with uh, hand printed material uh, or printed material that you can reference and keep at home, especially for those of you that are finding it difficult uh, due to whatever reason to interact with social media or on your computer. We want you to please remember to follow, follow uh, the close guidance issued by the governor on staying at home. And remember what is allowed when you're staying at home is outdoor activities with your family and your family only. And again, we would encourage you to take an extra walk with your pet, take an extra opportunity to be outside doing yard work and still be mindful of those distancing requirements when you're out interacting on those essential trips where you just have, don't have any other option but to be out. So again, those are the words of encouragement for you today and we'll continue to reach out to you. And before Thank I go, you. there's some additional information I wanna share about our community-wide transit system. Go West continues to operate. Their schedule is, uh, is as uh, would be operating during a break at the university. And then if you're in need of demand response, it is also still available if to you. Thank you.